yeah, this is the job today. Pressure washing this patio. Um, I like to treat it with a weak sodium hypochloride solution first. And then it just helps the job along. So Craig's already started cleaning up the top there with the flat surface cleaner. It's quite green and there's some areas that are quite shady. Um, it's kind of a walled area all the way round and then it opens out a bit further down. So I prefer to do it this way round. Same with cleaning when I'm cleaning UPVC. I spray it with a cleaning solution first, then clean it. It's all cleaned, off you go to the next job. Kind of feel like the same principle here. I like to treat it with the sodium hypochlorite. If I can clean it off with the first go with the flat surface cleaner, and then I don't have to come back at the end and give attention to any other bits. I can just clean it, done, off I go to the next job. So, so that's the way I like to do it. I know other people like to um, treat it with some sodium hypochlorite afterwards in areas that need that specific attention. This is just the way I do it and I find it works. I find it, the experience, the more you, jobs you do, you look at a job and you think that's going to need a bit of an extra kick with the sodium hypochlorite. So that means that there's not so much need for pressure. I think some people look at pressure washing and the more pressure you get, the better it's going to clean. But the more pressure you use, sometimes you can damage the surface. So that's why I prefer this approach to do it this way, really. The patio turned out all right, didn't it, Craig? Yeah, just nice yeah. job. Craig's done a nice job did there. Good job, there. Whoever did that. <laughs> um, and it's a nice spring day, so it's nearly dried out as well. After the pressure washing the windows, just get a little bit of spray on them. So I usually try and tie it in with the window clean, uh, so we make sure we leave everything nice and neat. You wipe down all the woodwork, make sure everything's nice and neat and tidy. So, good job Craig. Deserves a well-earned cup of tea. <laughs>